Today, a judge rules there is enough evidence to send a Mobile County science teacher before a grand jury. Hankins Middle School teacher Andrea Slade is accused of sending a topless selfie to a former student. News 5's Emily DeVoe was inside the courtroom where the prosecution revealed some disturbing details about the incident. Andrew, do you have any we have no comment. No comment. A camera shy, Andrea Slade and her lawyer rushed past us on their way out of court this morning. During today's hearing, a detective testified Slade and a 15-year-old former student were talking about the movie Fifty Shades of Grey. The teenager asked if Slade was freaky, and she responded with a topless selfie. The prosecution believes the picture was sent via Snapchat and screenshotted. Now, since the picture disappears in a matter of seconds, it's nearly impossible to tell who originally responded. It. This photograph went viral, essentially, on the Internet. By the time the particular student it was sent to was interviewed, he had already deleted it. Cell phone is in the possession of the um, you know, forensic experts, and they should be able to pull it back up. The teenager was in Slade's 8th grade science class at Hankins Middle School. He graduated two weeks before the incident apparently happened. The teacher statute does not apply here because he was not at her school any longer. The defense attorney pointed out the teen denied getting any pictures from Slade and even told investigators she never made any advances toward him. Superintendent Martha Peake says Slade is banned from the classroom while the case is in court. It's very difficult for the school for the system, and I'm sure for the families involved. After hearing both sides today, a judge ruled there is enough evidence at least to send the case to a grand jury for them to decide. If Slade is found guilty, she'll lose her teaching license and have to register as a sex offender. The real test is going to be whether or not the prosecution can prove she actually sent the picture directly to the 15-year-old or did he just get a hold of it because it was all over the Internet? Live in the newsroom, Emily DeVoe, News 5. Thank you, Emily.